and this question it is given that if coefficient of real expansion is gamma r that means the gamma of liquid coefficient of expansion of liquid is given as nothing but gamma r and that is one percent more than the coefficient of apparent expansion apparent uh, expansion so we can try it one percent of gamma apparent so let's say the apparent expansion divided by a uh, hundred into one so this is one percent of gamma apparent so this is one percent more than gamma apparent that means gamma apparent plus one percent of it so we can write this as equal to nothing but 1.01 .01 into gamma apparent so that is the value of uh, gamma of liquid or the gamma r real expansion then the linear expansion coefficient of material is so we can use this equation gamma apparent is equal to gamma of liquid minus gamma of container so we can write this value of gamma of container is gamma of liquid minus gamma apparent and the value of gamma of liquid is given as 1.01 .01 times of gamma apparent minus this gamma apparent so 1.01 .01 minus 1 we can take 0 0.01 times of gamma apparent is a value of gamma of container so we can write this three times of gamma can be written as three times of alpha so three times of alpha is nothing but uh, 0 0.01 times of gamma apparent so we can write the value of gamma of container is 0 0.01 divided by 3 into gamma apparent but in options you can observe that the answer is not given in terms of gamma apparent but the answer is given in terms of gamma of liquid or real coefficient of expansion and from the first relation you can write gamma of uh, this uh, real coefficient of expansion or gamma of liquid is 1.1 into gamma apparent so we can write the value of this gamma apparent is gamma of a real coefficient of expansion divided by 1.01 .01. so instead of this gamma apparent we can just put this value so this is going to be 0 0.01 divided by 3 uh, into this gamma uh, r divided by 1.01 .01. so if i'm multiplying both side by 100 means the numerator and denominator so this is going to be 1 into gamma r divided by 3 into 101 or you can write this as gamma r divided by 3 into 101 we can take it as 303 